Just under a quarter of a mile along 63rd Avenue separates Harold W. Smith School from Glendale High School. For the last three years, 8th grade students from Smith have made that trek in order to study algebra together with freshmen from Glendale High. This year, a record number of students signed up to take part in the program and to successfully complete the course to earn high school credit even before they were promoted. Oh, I love the 8th graders. It's, it's kind of refreshing to have the 8th graders because um, they come in here with a, a really eagerness to learn. And so sometimes, a lot of times, it catches on to the freshmen and it actually makes the entire class better. I wanted to see how it was. Like my brothers, from when, when they went to high school, they all said it was nice. And I wanted to have the same experience that they did. And I also wanted to like, expand my knowledge. I wanted to be like smart. I wanted to be a step further than other kids. I think it's a motivation factor. These students want to, are motivated to learn more as eighth graders. They want to push themselves academically. And I think also the teachers are encouraging them to do so. The eighth graders this year are, are performing at a really high level. Most of them have A's and B's in the class. I don't even think there's a C. So they're, they're, they're performing at really high levels. That's got to make it. All 20 of them. I mean, there's like, there's 20 eighth graders, and for all of them to have a B or an above is really impressive. I don't know, it's just easy for me. When I first started teaching the eighth graders, it was a few handful, and then and then the next year we had to split them and then and then this year there's 20 of them in one class I mean I, I think because of this the, the success that has happened it's trickled down and so more kids are wanting to do this I attribute the increase to students wanting to push themselves um, seeing other students in the past do so and be successful with it how they, how they teach it to you it's like really like quick and quick and fast. I think the teachers are, are great and the learning is it's, it's, it's not hard but it's not it's like all right. Oh, wow they, these kids are really smart and they really want to learn it. I think it helps prepare them for entering high school and not having such a difficult transition once they become freshmen. Oh, I think it really helps the eighth graders coming into a high school setting because the next year when they come in, they they have an advantage of, you know, of already taking a, a class and the, maybe the nerves that they would have had coming in their freshman year, they're probably not going to be as nervous as they would have if they hadn't taken the class. And, you know, they get to see, hey, well, I can do this. I think they're a little bit more a little bit more shy than the typical freshman, but 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 be, but they almost want to show up the freshman because they're the they're the little eighth graders and they they want to prove to the ninth graders that they're they're better than them. You need to be more responsible with your work and like your own stuff. It actually challenges the freshman that to do better because the eighth graders are more motivated. So there's a lot of future. Uh, positives that go along with them taking their algebra as eighth graders. I also think it's um, pushing them with their academics and really motivating them to want to do better for themselves. They, when they feel their success, they go, well, I'm, they look forward to high school. I do think the success that we've had in the math classes could translate to history, science, social studies, or whatever class they took, English, I think it would translate. 